Art Pop by Lady Gaga was leaked. And I'm excited. <laughs> Yay! Y'all like my nice shirt I put on just for the video? I mean, it's a special occasion. Art Pop is out. Let's start. This is so exciting. Number one is Aura, and oh my god, this song is just pure sledge. Do you want to see me naked, lover? Do you want to see underneath the covers? Like, that shit's deep. It could mean, like, do you want to see my penis? Or it also could mean, like, my heart. Like, do you want to see the real me? Number two is Venus. And this song came out a couple of days ago, actually, and literally, I was like, holy shit, the verses, the verses are the best part. It's about aliens and, um, planets and take me to your leader. Where does she come up with these things? She probably saw E.T. Oh my god, she's copying E.T. Oh my god, someone call Madonna. And it sounds like she says penis in the song, I'm just saying. Third is G.U.I. And this song, like, it's good, but it's not single material. Four is Sex Dreams, and this is my favorite song on the whole album. It's literally just, like, so hot. And it's steamy, and it's, it has three X's in it, not just one. It's, she's going for the porn addicts. Help me help! It's kind of nasty. Uh, help me my favorite part. <laughs> kind of butchered it though. It needs to be like the anthem of the sexual people. Next we have number five which is Jewels and Drugs featuring T.I., Too Short, and Twista. It's a banger song. It should be on bangers. Miley Cyrus's album. This is definitely my least favorite song on the album. I just think it doesn't fit in whatsoever. It's just there. And then there's number six, which is Manicure. Like, it's kind of teeny bopper for her style. Like, it's just this manicure over and over. Like, it's not a bad song. I'm sure a lot of people love the song. It's a pretty good song. Seven is Do What You Want With My Body. And like I said before, it's just the sexiest pure sex song and apparently it isn't about sex it's about like her like in the public eye or something something deep like that but come on look at the single color it's her asshole we can't we can't belong together or pop this is one of my favorite songs and the way that she dances when she performs it she's like just totally Hi, and like a floppy noodle, very Miley Cyrus. Swine. It's a good song, but I think it's about Perez Hilton. I'm not saying that he looks like a pig or anything like that, but I'm just saying that it's about like a pig inside a human body, and he bullies the shit out of Gaga. You, Perez, you just sit down. His heart is like a black piece of turd. <laughs> Ten is... Donatella. It isn't the best thing ever. Like, it doesn't stand out to me that much compared to like sex streams and like art pop and do what you want. But like, it's, it's, it's a good song. I would bop to it in the car. It's me bopping. Isn't it cute? Fashion exclamation point is a pretty good song. But I have a problem with the exclamation point. Exclamation point makes it look like it's a teeny bopper song for some reason. It makes it seem like it's just gonna be like fashion, nail polish, nipple pasties. Mary Jane Holland, it's a good song. Again, not one of my favorites. And then there's Dope. Like it's that song that she performed at the Swine Fest, but she called it I Wanna Be With You or something, but they like changed the words or something and now it's called Dope. Dope, sounds very Lady Gaga. It's a good ballad, but it doesn't compare to the next song that's called Gypsy, which is one of my favorites on the album too. It needs to be a single, like it's just so beautiful. And I love the name, I don't know why, but it sounds iconic. Gypsy, like, Whoa, who thought of that? It's just so perfect, it just makes like my nipples go crazy. What am I saying? Half the time, I don't even know. Someone put me into a psych ward, please. Applause. It should not have been the first single. I feel very passionate about this because there's so much better songs on the album. There's Sex Dreams, there's Gypsy, there's so many better songs. Ugh. I should be a fucking producer and pick this shit. I swear I'll get every hit. That's the album. And I think that I'll give it 9 out of 10. And it's only 9 out of 10 because first of all, Jewels and Drugs. And there's some fillers on this album. Thumbs up the video um, if you enjoyed it. And also a thumbs up for Lady Gaga and Art Pump. Because Art Pump is the art and the pop and the life of the Art Pump. It's deep. Oh, bah, bah. Do you like the little hand moments? When I lay in bed, I touch myself on the like, oh. Y'all gonna have nightmares about that move. <laughs>